Oh, God. I am drained. I really am. Um. Fuck, I don't even know where to start. Jesus, there's too much going on. Um, I took a nap yesterday and I woke up super, super sick. I don't know if it's because I was in Vegas and then I came to New York. I'm really not sure why I'm sick. But um, Lex ended up getting me some um, night quail. And I'm pretty sure it's working. Honestly. He took some as well because even though he's not sick, he's just saying that he don't want to get sick because <clears throat> he's going out the country, I guess, Wednesday. I leave tomorrow. He leaves the following day. I woke up with text messages, missed calls from my dad saying that I'm a bad parent and I'm like, What? Why is everybody so... First of all, I'm not even going to get into that. But why is everybody so judgmental? When I say I cannot wait... I'm ready to move out of Vegas. I really am. I'm ready to go. I hate Vegas. I'm just ready to go and get out of Vegas. Me and Lex agreed that I did need this trip to rest because I wasn't resting. I wasn't sleeping. I'll, I will probably get, when I'm in Vegas, I probably get about two, three hours of sleep every day. So, honestly, I'm low key sad right now because I low key want to make things official with Lex before I leave, honestly. And um, he haven't asked me to be his girlfriend yet, so. And I'm not gonna act the Lulu. I'm not gonna be begging. Like we're not, we're not, we're not doing that. We're not begging nobody for shit. Like we're not doing that. I woke up with messages from my dad. Okay, so let's just left to um I guess go walk his dog, change clothes. I don't fucking know. I don't really care at this point. I'm just so over everything. Like I'm the type when I'm in a relationship, I wanna move super, super fast. Like well, I've never really been in a relationship like that, but when it comes down to relationship, I want to move as quick as possible. Not really in every aspect, but as far as, like, um, I would like to solidify things as soon as possible. I would not have taken no trip out here. The only reason why I took this trip to solidify is to solidify our relationship. If not, I'm just gonna, you know, I'm gonna still love him. I'm gonna still be in love. I'm just gonna, you know, wait, but I'm not gonna wait too long, you know. But, um, I mean, I'm probably not gonna wait past December. I'm not waiting past December. He got about two more months. He got about two more months for sure. Honestly, what really fucked my morning off today was my dad calling my fucking phone and texting me saying, I'm a bad parent. I'm like, what? Nah, that shit don't resonate with me. Never been, never will be. He must be, he must be projecting from his own insecurities and feelings because he, I mean, if I'm, a, if I'm not mistaken, he's the one who had a child. And never did nothing for them. Like, this shit crazy. Like, I'm not in the game of begging. I'm not in the game of... I just can't do it. So, if you don't give me an answer tonight, I board my flight 9 o'clock in the morning. I have a layover in Atlanta. And then from Atlanta, I go to... um. To Vegas. 
But remember, I need to catch a flight to Louisiana to drop my kids off for a month. And, uh... I'm going to be back. I'm pretty sure. I actually, I actually want to live here. I apply for some jobs while I'm out here. I just I applied for a few jobs last night. And they're paying really well for the field that I'm in. So, like $28, $30. Some jobs. Some jobs. But the Four Seasons, for the job that I do, they're paying like $28, $32. Like, ooh. Ooh, I hope I get that. I will, fl I will come right back if I get that job. I need that job. I would love to move out here. I actually like New York. I'm enjoying it, honestly. Even though I'm not in the city right now, I'm like in the suburbs, but um, I'm really, I'm enjoying it. Um, honestly, y'all, I'm not even gonna lie. I think, I think I'm slow with the talking because it's this damn NyQuil. Because I am sick, but I do wanna put some content out here because I know when I get back to Vegas, shit gonna be like low-key super busy. It's a lot going on. I'm waiting on a message from the help of Southern Nevada, the people that's paying my rent in my apartment because I'm ready to move in. So I'm pretty sure they're going to pay my rent around the 1st, which is going to be the end of this week, which is perfect. And then they'll give me a month to come up with the money because I can go drop my kids off in Louisiana. Let's give me a month to come up with the money. Oh, Lex is calling. One second. Shit. Why this man just called me and told me he on his way to jail? Okay, so he said he had um, a suspended license, and I guess in New York it's not as bad. So basically, he just got to pay a fine, and they're they're gonna let him out. So he'll be out in a couple hours. But really, why I why did I expect something to be going wrong today? Like, I think he may be lying too. I think he's just trying to um, be gone for a couple of hours, be gone for a couple of extra hours. That's what I honestly think. He know I'm going to fucking trip the fuck out. Because he know I got home yesterday about spending time with me. So, I don't know what to believe. Maybe he lying. Maybe he not lying. I don't know. This is a little flyer, y'all. I don't know. Maybe he lying. Maybe he not lying. I don't know. I just don't believe he got a no suspended license. He's too responsible for that. From what, at least from what I know. Of course. I don't know, y'all. You have a bad dream? No. Honestly, you know what I just did? I just looked on the maps and figured out we, how do I get to the airport. Because I'm not going to, if, if he be gone longer than a few hours, I'm just going to hurry up and I'm probably just going to go right to the airport. I'm not missing my flight for nobody. And I got kids. But, um... I think I, I I'm pretty sure I'll be I'll be okay, but um I'm pretty sure he'll be okay as well. Do he have to get bailed out? I'm really not sure. I'm gonna be acting all like everything perfect either. I'm not gonna do that. Like we was arguing last night because I was telling him, you know, I came out here to make things official. Like what the fuck are we doing? What are we doing, sir? Um also, I'm not even tripping on if we make it official or not because I'll be back in December and if we don't make it official then I'm just I'm not waiting anymore. But it's only been four months, y'all. I can't get I cannot make him wanna I just I think it's just too too soon. It's too soon, you know. We came out here to see what the vibe is like. Well, I came out to see what the vibe is like, which the vibe is vibing. The six is sixteen. Some of the best six I ever had in my life. Uh, you know, you know, everything is working out. Everything is working out. You know, God got me no matter what. But, um, tell me why I knew he was going to say this. Like, I just knew what he was going to say. I knew he was going to say that. Like, when he left out the door, I'm like, hmm, some, I mean, when he left out, he was like, babe, take some more medicine, lay down, relax, get your rest. I'll be back by one o'clock. I'm going to walk the dog and change clothes. Grab you some soups, and uh, maybe I get some extra stuff. I forgot what he was saying, but um, um, yeah. 
though. This is like, I was not trying to hear nothing about, well, yeah, I remember I'm on a NyQuil too because I'm sick and I'm tired. I think if I was in Vegas and I was going through the sickness, it would be worse. It would be, it would get so much worse. But at least I'm here resting. Um, resting. Uh, yeah, I'll just be back here. I just want to update you guys day to day. But um, I'll be fine. I think he's lying. I'm not sure. I want to see proof. Yeah, I'll come back later. I just wanted to check in with you guys, see what's going on. I'm probably about to go outside smoking with the blunt. Uh, probably go warm up my chicken. Maybe warm up the pizza and just wait on my man to get back here. And hopefully we solidify everything before I leave. I know I'm being selfish and he's on his way to jail right now. I'm talking about solidified. Well, he's not, well, you know, it's, I guess... He'll be back, y'all. It's only so I looked it up online. That's why I'm not worried and stressed out. So if you get caught with a suspended license or you just gotta pay a fine, it's two hundred to five hundred dollars. <clears throat> the only thing that sucks about that he goes to Tokyo Wednesday, so it's like damn, he's gonna have enough money because I got I have a check that I gotta cash when I get back home. It's a thousand dollar check. So just in case he don't have enough money, I need, as soon as I get home, I need to go cash that check. And shoot him about five hundred dollars to make sure he got money on his Tokyo trip. But um, other than that, y'all, yeah.